So you've seen Holpi and Hellebuck do it. Uh, so naturally I get a ton of questions about it uh, and it's training your eyes. Welcome back to Goalie Training Pro TV. This is episode whatever, I don't know what episode it is, but we're gonna talk about training your eye muscles. So I'm gonna confess right now that I was a little skeptical about the whole eye training, puck tracking uh, stuff back in the day. But then I made friends with Josh Tucker, heard him present a bunch of times, saw some really compelling data that he presented. And you know, I think I, I'm so keen about training all your other muscles, why not pay some attention to the muscles that control your eyeballs? Cause it is muscles that move your eyes. So go grab a set of five pound dumbbells and meet right back here. I'm kidding, <laughs> you don't need any dumbbells, <laughs> but stay right here. I'm gonna give you today are two really simple exercises that train the muscles of your eyes to improve both your control and your mobility. I've got other drills that you know do a little more hand-eye coordination using a ball, that kind of thing. I'll post the links in the description below so you can check them out if you want. But these ones are just working on the muscles of your eyes. So the first one we're gonna do, and I'm gonna zoom in a little bit so you can see exactly what's going on. So look into my eyes. <laughs> so what we're gonna do is, we're going to try to keep our head really still and we're gonna trace as big a circle as you can with your eyes and really trying to make a really nice circle. So I'll watch this video back and see how I did, um, but it's not a bad idea if you video yourself with your phone just to see, cause maybe you're moving your head a little bit and you don't realize. Maybe you're good at going up, but once you get to the bottom, you kind of slide right across the bottom flat. So you're gonna do five going this way and then five going the other way. And you might find that one way is easier than the other way as well. So that'll help you just, just the same way when you do hand-eye coordination drills, you know, your dominant hand might be better, but the more you practice, the, the better it gets. The other one we're gonna do is diagonal. So trying to look from the top corner to the bottom corner. Top corner to the bottom corner, again, without moving your head, and then you'll go on the other angle. And you're gonna do eight to 10 of those, and you might even notice that the muscles in your eyes kinda get a little bit fatigued. Just take a rest, it's not, yeah, it's not like, oh, we're gonna make them strong. It's like, you know, just trying to get them working and moving. So ideally, you wanna be square to the puck, you want your head moving, you know, you don't wanna be looking over there to see the puck when you're making a save, but sometimes you, you, know, you don't always have that luxury and you need to really quickly get a sense of what's going on. So I think this does have good value. Then don't forget to go check out the other drills that I posted in the description box. They'll help you add in the hand-eye element of it. And then don't forget to let me know if you like this drill uh, or if you have any questions about hand-eye training, just leave it in the comment box below. Uh, I answer each and every single one of them personally, so I'll get back to you. Um, while you're down there, don't forget to like it or whatever. Uh, hit the bell, that tells you every time I post a new video, you can subscribe. It actually really, really helps uh, other goalies find these videos when you do that, so I really super appreciate it. And that's it. This is Maria from Goalie Training Pro TV. Thanks for stopping by again. I'll see you next time.